Hey guys, I'm Trent. I'm Michael. In this video, we're gonna show you guys how to set your server spawn with script. So we are on our panel here, and now we just want to create a script that will allow us to do like set spawn to set a spawn, and then players will be able to type slash spawn, and then they'll be able to go back to that location, whatever we had set it to. Pretty pretty uh, standard stuff. Yeah, yeah, like every like that's a very common thing that a lot of servers want to do. So mm -hmm. we're just gonna show you guys how to do that quick. Um, so I've already installed script. It's right here. Yep. And just a reminder, we're doing an advanced script tutorial, or more advanced. If you're unfamiliar with script, you've never seen it before, there's a whole playlist. You're going to want to start at the beginning. Yes, yes. Very important. Um, because then we're going to go over to the file manager. We're going to go straight to the script folder. And you're going to see that we've already deleted a lot of the default ones. We just have our tutorial.sk, which right now is empty. So we're going to start working on that. Um, but I'm going to head over to my text editor to make sure that if my server shuts down or something like that while I'm writing a script, I don't lose my progress. Let's do it. Um, OK, so the first thing I'm going to do is command slash set spawns. So we want to do the actual set spawn command. Um, I only want OPs to be able to run this, so I'm going to do permission OP, mm -hmm. and then once somebody runs it, we do trigger, and then we're going to do, we're going to have to create a new variable as we did in a previous video, yep. and we're going to assign the location that the player is standing at to that variable, that way we can reference it later. Sounds cool. Okay, so we're going to do that and call this variable spawn. Solve. It, it would have worked if I would have mistyped it, as long as I mistyped it in every oh, single spot. Yeah, so, you're defining your own variable, my dude. Exactly. So set spawn to location of block uh, at location of player. So this might look a little bit complicated, but what this is doing is it's setting the spawn to the block that the player is standing in. That way, it's not going to like be the half block over or something like that. It'll be right in the center of the block. So there we go. Um, and then we're just going to tell them um set spawn to and then we're just going to send them what the location is spawn mm -hmm. and then bam so now what that will do is it, it'll set that variable and then it'll send it back to the person that set it and it'll tell them what that variable is set to right there and it can only be run by ops mm -hmm. and we're gonna do the, the the two player and then this should be it okay. we're gonna copy. copy this bring it over here click that save button then I'm gonna hop in game and I'm gonna do SK reload tutorial. Bam, 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 there it is. So now we're gonna go set spawn. Yep, so I'm just gonna set the spawn to just, just right here. Okay. So it should just- Good a spot as any. Yep, set set spawn. <laughs> set spawn, there it is. So yep, it's set- And I get the cords. Yes, exactly. So it set it and it gave me the XYZ. It even printed, printed it in like a very pretty format. So mm -hmm. that, that was very nice. Um, so now we're gonna go over and we're gonna make it so people can do slash spawn. All right, so now we just need to make the slash spawn command, and we want anybody to be able to run yeah, this so one. Yeah, so this is not going to be a permission OP. This is for anybody in the server. Server. Anyone on the server can hit <laughs> slash spawn and go right to spawn. Exactly. So trigger, and then what we're going to do is just teleport, and then player to spawn. So since spawn is a location, the variable is a location, it should let us teleport to them. If you set the variable as like a text or something and you try to teleport them to it, it wouldn't work. I, I couldn't teleport them to the counter or something like yeah. that. Like but could you, could you put direct coordinates in there? I could, yes, if I wanted to define coordinates. Mm -hmm. uh, but I we had already defined those coordinates up here, so that's what it's going to send us to. And we're just going to send tele teleporting to spawn. Oh, so you get a message too. Yep, so we're just gonna let them know that we're, we're, we're gonna teleport them. And then we're gonna bring that over to our file manager. Mm -hmm. Click save. We're gonna head back in game and reload our script. Rewind selector. And then I'm gonna run over here and then I should just be able to type slash spawn and if it, it should teleport me over there. Let's check it out. Slash spawn. Whoa. Okay. Nice, and teleporting nice. to spawn, nice, it did it. Cool. And, that, and that's it. And then, so if I was a non OP, I would not be able to change the spawn point. And like, this is all you have to do if you just want it. So somebody can type slash spawn on your server at any time and then go back to your spawn point. Yeah, so, and whether you want to have a designated spawn or maybe you just want to have a home base that anybody can TP back to at any given point, super exactly. useful, very standard, lots of servers run this. Exactly. And that's how you set your server spawn with script. 